My name is Emily Mitchell. I was burned when my brother and I and my parents were driving back from my grandparents' house. We went to a restaurant so I could get my bottle. A waitress brought out a very hot cup of water. We don't know how it spilled on me, but it ended up spilling all over my neck. And so my self-confidence went down quite a bit, and I didn't smile as much. I would come home from school so sad, and I'd be like, what's going on? Why does nobody stare at anybody else? And then I would realize, oh, because I got a burn when I was little, and it has changed my life. You know, it is not easy to, to watch your child cry and to watch your child suffer and to, to deal with what they deal with regarding burns. Anything that can help their quality of life even improve, let's say, by 5%, I think it's worth it. When I was four months old, I had four surgeries. One of them included a skin grafting from my leg. Dr. Lanolin said, you know, time is in our favor and as time goes on, you know, new, new procedures are invented and, you know, we'll hope that someday something comes along for Emily. I'll never forget him coming into the room and he said, well, I have some good news. I have a possible treatment that could change the look of her, of her um, burn. The, the tears started, you know, going down my face. I had to, like, leave the room to gain composure. To have a child that goes through all this is is just, it's awful. Like you can't really describe the feeling to have to deal with this. And so to have the possibility of change is unbelievable. Now I've been recently having CO2 laser surgeries. I've had five of them so far in the last year. My first one was October 28th um, of 2011. The surgeries have erased some of the lines and have helped um, make it more my skin color and I am very grateful for it that I can now have more of the freedom to run around wear what I want to wear. I don't have to wear like high neck stuff. If you can look at pictures and if you can go back even a year and see the difference of her in a bathing suit or her in a semi-formal gown and her with her friends, it's, it's immeasurable and immeasurable for parents to see her happiness. Well, after my first laser treatment, I started realizing that this line that had always been there was almost gone and I was like, oh my gosh, where'd it go? And if I touched it, it became like very, very smooth, um, had its color went down to more my skin color and I remember going to my dance class three weeks after I'd been cleared and remembering the feel when I did the same dance move and how like much more free it felt and how I had such ability to do so much more. For each surgery, I think that it has continued to make so I can have a field of motion. The graph lines and the bumps from the graphs have continued to flatten out. Um, some of the lines that were so visible that if somebody was staying 30 feet away from me could easily see them have now flattened to a point where if someone was staying five feet away from me, they could see them. She has the ability now to just be herself. That is the ultimate goal, right, for a parent to see the happiness in their child. As I've gone through these surgeries, I've realized that these surgeries have changed my life just as much as my burn changed my life. And I can now talk to kids. I've made so many friends in the last two years. I was very excited to be able to be confident with myself and be able to run around and do dance moves that um, I couldn't do because the I couldn't put back my arms as far because it resisted. Now when I do them, I feel more free, like I can move. I love to perform in front of people. I love the feeling. I love when they smile and they clap. <laughs> and it's wonderful. And now after all these surgeries, I have made it onto a dance team that I love. I have a dance competition coming up in January that I am so excited for. I have so many new friends on my dance team and they're all so amazing and nice to me. So I think it really has given her the confidence to be herself and she does have a bright light. You know, she's an amazing person and just has so much to give and to offer. And I think in some ways 
this has inspired her to a new route in her, in her life, and I think in that sense, it's, it's let her be herself. If I was staying in front of a doctor, I would tell him, these surgeries have meant so much to me, and they're amazing. And I think that there are so many kids out there who need and want these treatments so badly, but they just don't know what they are yet, and they just don't think that there's anything out there that can help them. It's worth the time and energy spent to believe in, in this. The results prove themselves. I mean, there, there's really, time is just a wonderful thing, and to see the changes, they, they need to believe. This surgery can change your entire lifetime, and would you rather just sit on the couch regretting it, or would you rather you know, live a lifetime of confidence and go on through your life with this amazing surgery, this amazing chance? I would really, really hope that they would take this chance.